hypnotism with children and human traffic those people are smart they abuse other people and children this crime is hard to uh, to do something about it um, those people abuse logic many criminals do the same thing so uh, for example they could uh, deal pot and uh, grow pot at home and in the meanwhile they are winning money with something else with human traffic and uh, yeah, uh, great ideas they can uh, use for themselves and their victims can't uh, have any money or just a little bit and uh, yeah they can can't do nothing about it and they and the criminals can say why would wh why would I grow pot at home if I am doing human traffic that's the logic why should I do that you know or uh, yeah why would I uh, take the risk of uh, d of making money with pot if I'm doing human traffic there yeah but d the dealing and growing pot is just an excuse they can uh, can uh, buy a home they can they can buy a boat and uh, they cannot uh, get out of their home because it's uh, not rented it's a buy buy home it's their own home and yeah they have an excuse a reason how they came on the money this money is made by uh, growing pot at home i'm just a small criminal with uh, yeah i'm just smoking a little bit they can say that in the meanwhile they are big criminals and uh, also they can do if they have uh, a rented house they they could say yeah i have uh, sometimes i have a kilo coke i buy it uh, cheap and i sell it uh, expensive that is uh, the reason why i have more money they are smart they they are smart bastards and the victims are very innocent and uh, yeah if you cannot uh, give them a if you cannot catch them you cannot give them a, a lie polygraph a lie detector test the, yeah how could you uh, how can you get those bastards you know and if they have a boathouse some people have that they they buy a house and they have a boathouse also beneath the boathouse they can uh, dig a hole they may they can make a cellar inside under the boathouse and in the, and the soil they can uh, put it in the boat and put it uh, in the water the soil so no one see that they are digging inside the boathouse the cellar beneath the boathouse they can have victims inside or whatever whatever <coughs> so uh, yeah that's something about uh, human traffic and to think about and when people are a little bit uh, or whatever with medicine or uh, drugs or whatever yeah that's that sometimes human traffic people who uh, abuse children and men and women they can do that so that other people think oh that's uh, a, a drug user uh, that's uh, that's a weirdo that's some, someone who lives on the street and eats from the toilet uh, for example <laughs> yeah and everyone walks on by in the meanwhile those people are, can be victim of human traffic and they could be in fact hypnotized children that are became yeah, adults so uh, they are very innocent it's something to think about now this is me Peter Vieger from Holland, Friesland, Drachten.